everyone! Hope you guys are all doing well. I was recently looking through my closet and I realized that I have a lot of winter jackets. Some of which are more neutral and casual and some of which are very extra and pink and furry and I thought it would be fun to do a YouTube video where I'm going through all of my favorite winter jackets that I have in my closet because it's now December and the weather is getting colder. Even though sometimes in LA the high is like 50 something which doesn't seem cold when you live in California you're just not used to it so it is cold so I've been able to wear a lot of these heavier jackets this week because the high has been like 50 something every day and I've been living my best winter life in California. I'm also going home next week for Christmas which I'm so excited about and I'm going to be bringing some of these jackets with me because it is way colder in Illinois than it is here right now. I hope it snows though, I want to get some cute pictures. I thought I would show you guys my fun little coat collection, so let's go ahead and get right into it. I literally have them all in a pile right here, so I can easily grab them. They're heavy. I'll start with this one. This actually would look really good with what I'm wearing now. So this is one of my go-to trench coat winter jackets. This is a wool trench coat. First off, I love this kind of camel tan color. Is camel tan a color? It isn't like crazy heavy or anything, but it definitely keeps me warm whenever I'm in Illinois during the winter months. I got this jacket from Fangyan. I don't know if I said that right, but they have a ton of cute winter jackets. So I got this one from Fangyan. I love her. She also has um, a little belt that you can wrap around and tie in the front. I just wore this actually to a wedding in the snow outside, and it kept me so warm, and it looked really cute and really classy. Also from Fangyan... I have this white one. There's the, the brand name. Fangin. I don't know why I still have tags on this. I've worn this, no joke, like 10 times. Like, I have a problem, like, where I don't take tags off of my clothing just because I'm like, well, you never know what's going to happen. I'm just like, so weird. But this one is also made out of wool. This is like a really classic chic jacket. It has these really pretty buttons on the front. I feel like this would be great if you are like a businesswoman who's going into the office and you need like a stylish jacket to wear over your blazer and pants. I think this is a really cute jacket. But the color is just stunning. Your winter white. So now we have a fun one. This one I believe is from Revolve. But just look how fuzzy it is. It's so warm. And then the outside has this kind of like softer, almost velvety, not velvet, but just like a softer material. This one is super long as well. I think all my winter jackets I have are mostly kind of like trench coats, which I love a good trench coat. I think they're really fun to style. But this pink one, oh my gosh, it's just so fuzzy and comfy. Um, but it kind of like lays open so the collar is wider and it kind of like has thick bands of fur going down versus like going all the way up to your neck. So this is really cute paired with a turtleneck or a hoodie underneath. And this pink color is just everything. Now I have this black fur jacket, which is actually a newer one. I still have the tags on this because I have a problem. But just look at her. <laughs> so cute. So it has a faux fur collar and then on the sleeves it has these little fluff balls, which are so cute. I can definitely see like a fashion girly walking around New York in this jacket. I still will wear this in LA just because I need an excuse to wear the jacket. It's also nice when there's a belt because sometimes the wind is just insane and it's way too cold and needs to cover up more and you don't have to hold it shut. That way the belt kind of keeps everything closed. And now this one is very similar to the last one. I This is probably one of my favorites because... Obviously, it's pink, but it has the fur on the collar and the sleeves, which I'm, like, very into fur and feathers as of lately. And when you pair it with pink, like, it just overfills my heart, truly. This one also buttons down the front, so it has these cute little pink buttons. And then there's also a belt that you can tie in the front. This coat is perfect for all of my pink girlies. So this next one is... <laughs> I have so many extra jackets, like, I can't help myself. This one I got from Misguided. There's a tag on it. Guys, I'm, I'm realizing that I have an issue, so love that for me, but clearly there's a fur moment happening. The bottom of the jacket has this leather, almost like 
not snake skin, but like there's detailing in the leathering that you can visibly see. And then the sleeves, how fun are these? This one will definitely keep you warm, but just like the last two, it doesn't go up to your neck. It has like a V that's open in the front. So I always suggest wearing a turtleneck or maybe like a scarf with it. I'm actually not sure how a hoodie would look with this. Have you had the hood over the back of it because I feel like you kind of want to show off the fur so maybe you don't do that I'm also gonna be linking everything down below as long as it's still in stock I know that I got this last year so hopefully they still have it on the website there's a few of these jackets that I've had for maybe a year or two now so they may not be on the website but if I don't have it listed I probably wasn't able to find the link but fingers crossed I can find this one because it's so cute okay so this one isn't as heavy but this is one of my new favorite jackets that really just reminds me of Lizzie McGuire. I also used to have a jacket like this when I was younger. Um, it was brown, it had this type of material, and I really love that everything that was popular when we were younger is making a comeback now that we're adults. I think the color of this is super nice. This would look really cute with the bodysuit I'm wearing right now. Um, clearly I have a pattern of liking jackets that have the fur or the shirling Shearling? Why did I just say shearling? My brain's malfunctioning at the moment. I think this one has like little shoulder pads in it to add a little bit of lift. This one also has a belt. Again, love a belt in the front to kind of pull everything together. Wow, I really have a pattern of getting the same jackets because this one also has a V in the front. I promise my next jacket is not like this. This one is one of my all-time favorites. It's this long trench coat teddy jacket with these really cute buttons on the front and it's super long it goes like all the way down to my ankles and I have worn this so many times when in Illinois and it always keeps me so warm I love teddy material I feel like it's just so cozy it's very stylish very cute without looking like you're trying too hard but still looking super stylish because look how freaking cute this is I got this one from misguided maybe like two or three years ago for Christmas and I still wear this jacket probably the most out of all of them I will say it's a close second to the first jacket that I showed which is like the tan kind of camel color jacket this will forever be one of my favorites and I probably will never get rid of this so the last one is going to be a puffer jacket. This isn't typically a color that I wear. However, I was feeling like I wanted to try something different and I'm so happy that I did because this is now one of my most worn jackets. It's so cute, so stylish, and I actually really love the color on me. A tag, what do you know? It has this cute little ski logo on the front, but I have a sweatshirt that goes really cute with this. You could do sweatshirts, hoodies good old turtleneck. I'm really happy that I stepped out of my comfort zone and got a different color puffer jacket than I normally would. Okay you guys that is it for this winter coat haul. I do have a few more but I don't want to bore you guys or overwhelm you so we're gonna stick to some of my favorites for the moment. If you like this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below which jacket of mine was your favorite. If you're not already make sure you follow my Instagram at Lauren Ludo. I've taken tons of pictures in these outfits if you're looking for any style inspo. Make sure you subscribe to my channel so you never miss any videos that I post. You can also hit the bell button so you get a notification every time that I post a new video. I love you all. Thank you so much for your support and I will see you guys next time. Bye!